what is up everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome if you guys are new here my name is Lori I am a family nurse practitioner and in today's video I want to talk all about accreditation yes the good old accreditation for these nursing programs one of the reasons why I wanted to talk about this is because by now you guys have seen the news about the fake nursing degrees nursing diplomas that is coming out of Florida and a lot of folks are having the discussion about different things myself included one of the things that I always tell potential nursing student is that number one things that you need to make sure that a school has is accreditation. And a lot of students are saying, well, why? Why does it matter that the school is accredited? The big reason why it matters is because if you go to a school that is not accredited by the state board or nationally accredited because a school can either be accredited and approved by just the State Board of Nursing or and I will say or and because they they can have both be nationally accredited and we'll touch on the two accreditation body that a school can be nationally accredited if they have none of these you will not be able to take board you will finish that nursing program and you will be left in the dust holding nothing all that time energy and money that you put into that program will be for nothing you will not be a licensed nurse to work and there is no hospital that's gonna hire you without a license to work that's why they're stealing folks license number you need to have it let's talk about accreditation what is accreditation this is how accreditation is defined it is defined as a voluntary self regulatory process by which non-governmental association recognizes educational institution or programs that have been found to meet or exceed standards and criteria for educational quality quality. So basically schools that hold accreditation are required to uphold certain standards. In my experience, even the best of the best nursing school, they do not do the best job in teaching you everything that you need to know to perform the duties of a true nurse. Two national accreditation bodies are as follow. Number one, Accreditation Commission for Education in Nursing, and that is the ACEN, and this is a national accrediting body Body, which provides accreditation to schools offering diploma, associates, bachelors, and also post bachelor's degree. I will link their website down below so you guys can click on it and read through. The next one is the Commission of Collegiate Nursing Education, which is a CCNE. And this one is a national accrediting body associated with American Association of Colleges of Nursing, provide accreditation for bachelor's, graduates, and residency nursing program there are certain jobs that require you to go to a school that is nationally accredited i.e the va in fact there is currently a lawsuit put forth by a couple of students that went to a community college. This community college is actually in Oregon. And these students are actually suing the community college because they went to graduate from this community college. And then when they went to apply for a job at the VA hospital, their application was denied. And the reason why the VA denied their application was because the community college did not have a national accreditation. They are approved by the State Board of Nursing and the students did of course go on graduate take NCLEX because the school is approved by the State Board of Nursing accredited by the State Board of Nursing. However, the students stated in their lawsuit that when they started the program it was national accredited and that was one of the reasons why they actually even went to that school. During their two-year time at the school the school withdrew their own national accreditation from the accredited body. Now, why would a school do that? I don't know. Why would you have national accreditation for your school and you decide to withdraw the national accreditation and then leave these students that started your program with knowing that, yes, it is national accredited in the dust? Like, that is not fair. Do I think these students have a leg to stand on? Of course, I do. 
if I am buying a product from you and you misrepresented that product, you lied to me. And when they entered this program, it was all splashed all over their thing that it is national accredited. They didn't even lose their accredit accreditation. They withdrew their national accreditation. So mm, why is that? I don't know. Are they not doing what they were supposed to be doing and they were going to lose it? I don't know. But yes, these people should sue them and because that's ridiculous. Make sure, like I said, go to the State Board of Nursing, wherever you live, and just look at approved schools that you should go to. Do not fall for the scam and the trickery with these folks that are popping up these nursing programs in these shopping plazas to take your money. You do not want to be so desperate to become a nurse that it clouds your judgment. It's going to be all for nothing. You're going to lose money, you're going to lose time, and it's going to be a headache for you. Some of you guys probably don't care if it's nationally accredited or not, as long as it's accredited. But if you want to work certain jobs, certain jobs require that your school that you go to is nationally accredited and not just by your state board of nursing. That is all I have. Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are if you know somebody who is trying to get into nursing program share this with them so that they can be aware because we need to bring awareness to these things so that we do not fall victim in the scams all right guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel on your way out and i will catch you guys in the next video bye guys